Hey everyone and welcome to another Sim tutorial. Today I want to show you how to 100% take walls in Fortnite. But before I will show you how to set it up, here is a quick demonstration of the trick. It will work with any weapon and all you have to do is to make sure that the enemy wall is on low health so that it can be destroyed with a single shot. Once that is the case, I just have to press a single button and the Xim will automatically destroy the wall and replace it with my own one. You can do that as often as you want to, just press your take walls key and the enemy wall is yours. As you can see, after each execution my character is back in the shooting mode, but if you prefer to stay in the building mode, then I will show you how to do that as well. Now go into your Xim manager and load your Fortnite config. I will use my config from a competitive Fortnite config tutorial, but the trick will work with any other config as well. Go into the editing mode and swipe one time to the right. Memorize your hip settings here, my sensitivity is 27 and my synchronization is default. I'm not using any other advanced settings, but if you do, you have to write them down as well. Now swipe two times to the right and enter a new sub-config. Activate the config and assign your desired walls key to it. By pressing that button, you will shoot the wall and replace it with your own one. I will use my X key on my keyboard. Untick the inherit box at the top and check if the delay value is set to zero. Now copy your hip settings into the subconfig. My sensitivity is 27 and the synchronization is default. After that scroll down and bind your activation key to the fire action. Next we have to create a new subconfig and copy most of the steps that we just did. So assign your waltz button to the activation key, untick the inherit box and change the values until they match your hip config. Once you have done that, set the delay value to 20. After that, bind your waltz key to the fire and building mode action. If you prefer to stay in the building mode after taking a wall, then your config is done here now. But if you want to be back in the shooting mode, then swipe one more time to the right and do the same steps as before. So bind your activation key and copy your hip settings. This time however, we will not untick the inherit box. Once it is done, you have to set the delay value to 100. The last step comes now. Swipe once again into a new subconfig and follow the same steps as before. So copy your hip settings and bind your waltz button to the activation key. This time we will also untick the inherit box again. After that set the delay value to 120. At last you have to scroll down to the button bindings. There you have to bind your waltz key to the build mode action. That is already it, you can save your config and exit the configuration mode. You now have to just damage a wall in the game and once it can be destroyed with a single shot, you just have to hold down your take walls key. Guys, if you like this video, hit the like button or even subscribe to this channel. And for the crazy guys out there, you can even support the channel now by becoming a channel member. I'd really really appreciate that. Channel members also get exclusive benefits such as early access to all new videos. Also let me know if you would like to see more of these tutorial videos and don't forget to post your own suggestions in the comments down below. But that's about it for this video guys. Thanks for watching and I will maybe see you in the next one.